Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll show you how you can get network speed, CPU information and other stuff in your menu bar on your Mac. So let's get started. For this, we need to install an app called iStart Menus. So open any browser and search for iStart Menus. and click on this link and click on download this will start downloading once the download is completed double click on it and click on open this will ask you to install some components for the app so click on install and enter the password to install helper and click on install helper. Once done, you will see the network speed and other stuff in the menu bar. And in the app, we have the settings to customize. If you don't want notifications, you can turn it off and you can also add weather to your menu bar. Here, you can see it is asking to enable location. So let us turn off this. And next, we have CPU and GPU. When we click on the CPU icon, we can see a lot of stuff like how much CPU the user and system is using. Next, we can see the current running processes. And also, we can see how much the memory and processor are using the graphics. Next, we have the uptime. From here, you can open apps like Activity Monitor. So let's open it. Normally, we can see all the CPU and other information here. But with this app, we don't need to open all these apps to see all this information. We can directly see all the stuff from our menu bar. Next, by clicking on the memory icon, we can see which services and apps are using the memory and how much they are using. Next, we have the SSD icon, which is the hard disk. In this, we can see how much space is used, how much is free, and the perchable storage, and also some options like eject and force eject. And next is important one which is the network speed by clicking on it we can see the network in that we can see public ip address and the private ip address next we can see the graph of downloads and uploads next we can see the information about the connections like bluetooth and thunderbolt bridge and next we can see which process is using how much internet and network speed next is the sensor icon here we can see the information about the sensors and also we have the exhaust rpm next is the battery icon it shows more information than the regular systems battery icon in the menu bar and in the global settings we can choose the update frequency when we set it to fast it will quickly update the information and also it takes extra power and memory so now let us test the cpu and network speed i'll open safari and play one of my youtube video Meanwhile, a subscribe would be awesome. We can see the information of CPU performance and in the network speed, you can see the upload and download speed and it is updating quickly. So far, this app is not free, but I have a small tip for those who don't shut down their laptops for several months. So let's see. After setting up, you can delete the app. So let's delete this app. I normally use an app called App Cleaner which helps to delete any application with all the folders related to that application from the system. Now you can still see all the icons in the menu bar. This is because the data of app is still running in the memory and once you reboot or shut down the laptop, all these icons will be removed. So that's it for the video. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.